Good afternoon, this is Brian with Forks Fortunes Club again. This is going to be a follow-up tutorial for the um, strategy tester and how to optimize the uh, moving average crossover expert advisor. That's currently um, standard in most MT4 platforms. So what we're going to do again is go up to strategy tester. Now on the previous test we used on our drop down we went to the moving average crossover by the meta quotes. Uh, that's usually the standard one with most MT4 packages. Going to use the 30 minute time frame every tick um, using the same date range from the 10th to the 12th um, or the October 10, uh, 1st to December 1st. And what we're going to do is go into, um, we're going to collect uh, or um, check the optimization, go to expert properties. And what we're going to do is check the moving period and moving shift. And we're going to um, try different moving period values here. So it's going to start using the, the 12 moving period average, increase that by 1 up to uh, 18 as the um, top moving period. We're going to start the moving shift here at 3 and increase it by 1 and move it up to 8. So um, what you want to do is make sure the visual mode is checked off and we're going to hit start. And what you're going to um, notice here in the optimization graph, you're going to start seeing some of these data fields um, being filled in as as the results come in. So right now we're on the first pass of 42 different um, tests it's going to take using the different combination of moving averages. Um, so we'll just let this uh, go through. So it's initially it's going to going to take a while and it's going to uh, disregard a lot of the insignificant results in the optimization graph here. If you go to the journal, it's going to show you that the uh, optimization has started. Um, and it's working through the the different passes now. Still no significant results. Okay, we are back with our optimization results. Um, once the You'll see the progress bar complete when, when the test is done. Um, if you go to the journal, there are 42 passes. 36 have been discarded as insignificant. But our most uh, important thing here is the, uh, it shows you the different profitable moving averages. So um, in this time period, if you were to just change your settings to the uh, 18 and 6, you would have ended up with a $486 profit. Um, it seems th that the longer time frames here are more profitable. Um, and if you go to the optimization graph, you can kind of get a, a visual representation of, I think it takes into account the, the drawdown and the um, profitability of each, of each uh, different pass that it made. So. It kind of shows you how to increase your, um, you obviously want to optimize this very regularly, maybe once or once a week or um, every other week just to kind of change your your uh, moving average time frames to uh, match current conditions. So um, that is it for the uh, moving average crossover optimization. If you would like more information, please visit our blog at uh, www.forexliveblog.com or www.forexfortunesclub.com. Thanks.